My name is Dale Fix and welcome to Distant Worlds Universe. We're playing as the Slucken. And we've been at it for quite a while. Now I've been told that there are three major guys um, that have started an alliance and wow, they did. Uh, and it's not just a three. Um, they have mutual defense pact with probably all of these guys. And if this comes to war, if they are coming from me, then <laughs> there's not much I will do. Oh boy, um, this is really bad and we need to be working on that. Now, before we are able to do anything about it, there are a few things that I need to be doing. One is, of course, colonizing still and we are uh, doing, well, I hope we're doing well. Uh, we're just keeping the taxes up. Some of them are a bit too happy for my liking. And we need to do something about that. Look at this, 27%. And we're not taxing them to the best of our ability. So we're looking at that. There, this is the tactical interceptor. And there you go. That is the message. Forget what I said last time. This is what you need for carriers. Thank you, Julius, for making that very clear to me during one of your streams. Also, Toby, thank you for letting me know that this is not the third it's not the, the first first for you. it's the, the second so this is ND and this is the third the fourth and the fifth it is this one then first, second, third, fourth fifth I don't know. I think it's this one. Fourth. Third. Second. Yeah, it, it has to be like... TH. Now, I'm not happy with these. <laughs> I'm not. Uh, I really am not. Uh, I think they're too weak. And even though we have been doing our best, one of our admirals dying last time, definitely not how we should have been doing this. And uh, The second fleet had... Really taking a pounding over here, and we knew that was going to happen. We knew that. We sent in that fleet, and we knew this fight is going to be uh, huge. So that's definitely something that we uh, we need to be changing eventually. And I want to do that as soon as we have the um, uh, the carrier class. I want to add carrier classes everywhere. Uh, these are all still flying. Don't need to change them. Our occupation force is doing well. So we will be attacking this pirate location as well. Uh, I don't feel the... I don't think... They're not as strong. Controlled colonies is, is one. They have a bunch of ships. They're not as strong. Uh, where is... Um, look, the fifth fleet is over here. Just selling you the, the mission that you'll uh, have to do. Where's the third one over there? And we'll send you in there as well. So we have two fleets that will be going their way. There are some tags that I want to be changing. And I want to go into energy collection after we've increased the uh, the, uh, the large scale side to 500. And we want to get into accelerated construction as well as uh, robotic defense. But this one... Is, uh, is definitely something. We can have our bases completely run on solar power. Now they're running on fuel. And fuel is already such a limited commodity at, at the moment. And it, that's why it takes so long for my fleets to get those better. Uh, get refueled. Now, is there something here that I would like to check? Optimize fuel storage is still something I would like to go and, and, and do. Trade bonuses. Colony development, colony income. I want to go to open trade just for the money. Now, the more money we have, the more ships we are able to produce. So, let's go two and let's go three. Open network. Is there anything else over here? Increases the chance of new fleet admirals appearing, which is not bad. Um... A vast type of galactic commerce spread across the hundreds of free-floating atmosphere platform. Oh, that is so nice. It's so darn expensive as well. How expensive would it be to... Ooh. Okay, maybe maybe not this one just yet. 
maybe just go with the um, enhanced commerce and the free open trade work. Uh, that would be extremely nice. So we definitely want to be changing a few things to our fleets. A seven years change cycle. We have an increased growth. That is great. Speaking of that, let's just make sure that we tax them just a tiny bit more. Um, like I said, my sweet spot is about 21. One more. 22. Come on now. You know what? 33 is still nice. We can definitely do a lot. Oh. 33 would be okay. How about you? 23. Oh yeah, I bet you do. I bet you do. Uh, I don't know how much tax we can get from this. They're not happy. And the enslavement. Yeah, sure. Why not? If we got slocken, they can be enslaved. Uh, if they change location, we'll, we'll enslave them. 21%, which is good. 27. Uh-oh. Oh my god, we have a call to war. Um, who is that? These guys. Oh no! Okay, the end. Guys, it is starting. It is already starting. <laughs> okay, we're, we're going to honor the call. We, we will honor the call. Let's say goodbye because this most likely will kill me. Um, what is this? Uh, my troops are still there. They're starting to be friendly. These guys we probably can tax up to 10. These guys up to... Uh, let's do 33, whatever. How about you? 25 and 0. Yeah, this is a bit too much. Yeah, it's a bit min-maxing at the moment. I'm sorry for that. I know, I know not all of you are happy to see that. Let's... Why does it not in decrease my speed? There you go. Let's decrease. Now with you. You can still go up a tiny bit. And I want to go doing this as much as possible without borders. That is great. That is really nice. We're pleased to offer your... Oh, wow. Well, okay, they are offering it, and we have it now. So why not? Why not? Is there anything else here? 21% is nice. 22%. Get up one more. Let's keep this one going. Three. Two higher. Lower. Lower. And we got a lot of money now. A lot. Coming in each month. Looking all very, very good. You can go up to. And you go up one. There you go. Okay, speaking of that. Um, since we currently now are at war. By the looks of things. They're furious with us. And they are 9,000. And we are. Where's the slokken? Why can I not find my own race? Because it's all the way up there. 11. So, I, I will see how this will go. It is quite a distance away, I think. I don't think they, it is these guys. They are... These guys down here. I don't know why they're at war with them. We can hit them. We can hit them very hard. Maybe it's something that we should be doing. And if we look at... What they would suggest me building, which I am not really agreeing with. Because I would like to wait for my tactical interceptors. Uh, well, we're, get, we're getting very close at doing that. So let's speed up the game. And we're going to be waiting here. My fleets are... They took out this base. So everyone... Are they still not been repaired? Go back. Go heal up as well. Everyone's going back now. And we might have to go in for war. 
Uh, I kind of want to do this. I kind of want to do this. Just go in there and, and have a bit of fun. And probably kill my game in the process. But what can you do? Feels so cool. Uh, are there potential colonies? Well, they are still building. Mm. Hostile population, which is quite weird. Considering we're so, so good friends. And there you go. They are heading towards... They are definitely going to war. Hmm... Should we queue up all of our fleets? You know, just, just getting all of the fleets. Here we go. It's 109 ships in total. We've got a lot of boarding strength. Let's make sure that our occupation force... Let's uh, select the fleet. And let's... Uh, load in troops. Uh, if we take it like you. Is there a way we can select... You guys, right? Hmm, maybe not the way I would like. I would really like to attack them. Um, just to see if we are ready. I don't know. I don't know if we are. Are our fleets able to reach that point? Oh, they definitely are. Quite a new uh, trait. Oh yes, he's corrupt. That's great. Great, thank you. Great. Uh, uh, we can increase this. And I don't mind spending a bit of money on that. Tactical interceptors is 22%. Uh, we don't have the money for that. We're building up quite nicely. There you go. It's 75. So we're building up nicely. We don't have to be the ones going in here for the attack. Although... These guys, they sure as hell are. And it's because they both have planets in the same region, by the looks of things. Yeah, we need to change that. Uh, we definitely want to attack them. I also would like to build more interceptors. More uh, escorts. More of the, uh, the evil scumbags. Why? Because they... Uh, we have 28. They do a good amount of work. But before we do, let's change something to the private bases. Uh, we need to be... Um... Actually, wait. Let's do auto-upgrade and manually upgrade. There's shields. There is armor. There's a, a nice amount of it. They have some defenses. Is there something that we could change? Hmm... Well, they have more than enough power, so if we can add a bit more weapons to them. Two more. As well as the mining bases. Oh. It's 93, so they have a bit less. That brings them over, that is not good. That uh, brings them over. We could add more reactors, but I don't want to. Size is already 517, which is, uh, in maintenance-wise, quite expensive. Um, construction menu. Let's go to mining. Stations. By roll, gas mining. That us all retrofit to new design. And let's make sure all of this is retrofit. Because some of these have been out here forever. And I don't think... Yeah, they're, they're not using any weapons. No, no, there you go. They are using weapons. But we're going to be retrofitting all of the mining stations into the latest design. There we go. We're going to do the same thing for... Do we have... We've got a few defensive bases. We might want to look at those as well. I haven't done so in a long, long time. Uh, let's see. Auto upgrade. Nothing changing. Is this the 
star base, how about you, defensive base, let's manually upgrade you. So, you're quite strong. You have more than enough in terms of power. Why did I not fill this completely? We have some point defense. They are on all weapons, so they are quite strong. They could definitely take down a few bases, and we got most of them just built next to our main planet. We might have want to build a few more next to other stations as well, just so we don't get killed. But I would like to start adding these fighter components, or maybe just two of them, and add more. There's a lot of missiles there. Let's add some of these face cannons. That's already seven. And let's do six. Most of them are six. Oh no, 20 blasters, 20 conclusion missiles. Uh, maybe add more point defense. This, this thing is so, so strong. The firepower. Really lovely. Really liking that. Can we add 10? No, that's too much. Yeah, that, that should be more than enough. Let us make sure that that happens. Go to... Um, defensive bases. <clears throat> and retrofit into... Wow, some of them have been so, so outdated. Retrofit all of these, please. Yeah, that's going to be something. With all of that done, we have more than enough money to speed up the new fighters. Because I would like to go into carriers. And carriers is going to be well added to my uh, to my fleets. I think, I'm, I'm hoping like two per fleet. We got five fleets at the moment, which is more than enough, I guess. And we'll be filling them up I'll probably to... I'm hoping like 25 ships. But uh, yeah, we'll have to wait until this is all done. Exploration ship. How is my occupation force doing? And they are filling up with troops. Do we want to add more troops? Well, not all of our planets have troops. Troops and garrisons. So we're going to be recruiting... Five on each planet. Oh, that's six. And for the time being, that should hopefully be enough. And we'll garrison most of these. So let it all be built. That will definitely take a chunk out of our cash flow. Uh, also, I, I've been told how to go on with the defensive things. It's um, it's not working the way I, I'd hoped. The, the thing is, attacking is... If I put them onto attack and I send them over here, they will start attacking. And they will do that quite well. And I'm quite pleased about that. Get this entire region. That would be... Making us so strong. Uh, we got a... Oh, there we go. This is just recruitment of new troops. More gifts. Thank you very much. Now, this is just a standard upgrade by the looks of it to this space commerce. But the open trade network... I think that is something we want. might want to be... Uh... The wonder is already built. Oh, that is a bit of a bummer. But it, the colony development and colony income is uh, is quite brilliant. Although I don't think I can build it. Or doesn't this work like civilization? Maybe. Just maybe. We'll see. Hmm. Regional capitals, low corruption, nearby. Oh, wow. We need this. We want to build a few of these. What we also want to be building on our planets are fortresses. So if we go to facilities, fortified bunker and fortified factory. 
Not sure what the factory is all about, though. So let's build both. I'm not sure if I want to build these on all of our planets, but hey, we might as well. Uh, if, if I'm doing that wrong, just, just let me know in the comment section, guys. We have the money, might as well use it. Man, who knows what it will do. I think we might... Why didn't it allow... It's not building it over here. So, I guess it's... It's not ready for that. Neither is this one. Neither is this one. Maybe this? No. So, we've been building these on a few planets. And hopefully that it will do something for them. And this one we'll be building up. We are building up troops quite nicely. To be sure that the game wasn't just falling behind and it just started to construct everything. I think it might be a money issue. I think that um, would be safer to assume. Yeah, definitely a money thing. And we're making enough. So we're building just everything. Hidden pirate base, protection, pirate protection offer, three-year cycle. Uh, we don't need no three-year cycles. Fortified bunker. We'll go to one of these planets. Uh, abandoned ship encountered, let's investigate. Do we still have ships that we could try to scrap for, um, for stuff? Let's see, click for details. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Doesn't tell us anything. So we are now able to build armored ground assault troops by the looks of it. So we didn't need this on all of our planets. Military Academy. So somewhere we have armored ground assaults and these enable us to make these new trips so if we go now to planets we should be going to heavy assault armored wow that is quite nice i do like that and not for now let's uh, keep the game running uh, these guys it's a uh, garrison can we select multiple of you? No. Do we have to do this by hand? Do we have to go to every planet? And garrison. Maybe just by going to troops. In here. If you're not on board. You're garrisoned. And some are still being made. So let's garrison. And we'll do that from here to there. Garrison selected troops. All of these are now garrisoned. Some militia is in there. Investigate those ruins. And these are garrisoned as well. We're still making more. We're still making enough. Which I like. So we're still waiting for the interceptors. So we can start building those carriers. Which I guess is going to happen next time. Let's close this. And I'm also reckoning once the carriers are done... We are going to war. We're going to be taking as much of this territory as possible. It is quite dangerous. Because I, I'd say they're, they're quite strong. They're, they are not 8,000. New ship flit at all. That is cool. Let us uh, send you to second fleet. Yeah, we'll have all of these, but we can definitely send them all to the... Okay. How many generals can be on here? Yeah, because they are just sitting there doing nothing. Go there. If we send them to Occupation Force, will it cancel? Or are they now both on the Occupation Force? Tactical Interceptors. You know what? Here we go. Um, this is going to be the final thing that we will be doing. Oh, we're going to be building those 
carriers, but that's bases. Um, updated to the automated design. Would we do buildable? Oh, we are. They are now buildable. Look at this. They are. Could we just build them as well? Would they be in here? Yes, we can build a bunch of carriers. That's great. I love that. Uh, let us start by uh, making it so. Construction bay. Uh, well, doesn't really matter where they're being built. We've got five fleets and I want ten of them. If we click here, we'll see that will cost us 13. Troop transports, we don't need more. We can also build the cruisers. So let's make ten of those as well, making all of our fleet so much stronger. So let's go. That's all a big ass order. That's a big ass order. I like it. So we're going to fleets. Actually, we're going to ships. Military ships. And let's see, carrier. The to the first. To the second. Third. Port and to the fifth as well for the cruisers this one needs to be changed or deleted I guess so we're going to be sending you to the second we're going to be keeping this one in mind we this might be the one that we just found but Ford and fifth this guy needs to be repaired. Please repair this guy. Do we not have construction ships no more? Is maybe that is the thing. Now we have plenty of construction ships. And some of my construction ships are all the way here. Because that makes so much sense. Not. Why are they there? Because we can, I guess. Why? So weird. Oh well. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. Uh, let me know in the comment section if I did something horribly wrong. Let's investigate the ship and the ship exploded. That's annoying. Oh, we're not researching. We should be researching, right? I guess that would be the uh, the best course of action. Let us research more into phaser intensity optimization. There you go. More, more and better weapons. I like. Well, thank you for watching, guys. See you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.